So uh, for our talk this evening, ladies and gentlemen, on literalism, uh, steam engines and the Vedas, a nice warm welcome for our speaker this evening. It's Dr. Rembert Lutherhams. Thank you. Um, the way I want to uh, do this is um, I will look at three main uh, uh, views on the Vedas. And uh, first I will look at a, a school called Mimamsa, which is one of the oldest schools of Indian thought that's unfortunately been largely lost in, uh, in the last couple of centuries, but a very influential school, and I'll say a bit more about them in, in just a moment. I will look at Shankaracharya, um, one of the greatest uh, Hindu thinkers who lived in the 8th century, and what he has to say on this topic. And then I will close with looking at a much more um, recent uh, person, uh, uh, Swami Dayananda Saraswati. According to Mimamsa, what the Veda teaches us is dharma. They say, the Veda is about dharma. That's the only thing the Veda is teaching. And dharma for them means particularly uh, Vedic rituals, the, the performance of the yagyas that are described and prescribed in the Vedas, that the Vedas teaches about and so on. What type of knowledge is the Veda teaching? Shankar says, it is Brahman. It teaches us about the Absolute. It teaches us about the nature of reality beyond this world, beyond this, 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 uh, per, this uh, temporary um, sort of illusionary world that we now inhabit. It teaches us about that which lies beyond it, which is Brahman. And that is who we are, uh, he would argue.